number of my teaching colleagues were in the staff room the other day and they got onto the subject of cancer. One of the girls was talking about some new treatment that her mum was having and my ears just pricked up because nobody knows that I had cancer because we went to Brisbane for all my treatment. But, oh, you know, it still gets me every time I hear somebody talking about it. it just makes the prickles go up on the back of my neck. I just never think about it coming back. I did miss my last follow-up appointment in Brisbane, just couldn't get through because of the floods. And I just haven't got around to making another appointment. It's just such a hassle to get down to Brisbane. Sam noticed a change in my other breast and she's really been going on at me about getting it looked into. But at my local GP, and you just got to find someone who's sympathetic to Sam and I in a lesbian relationship. And then they start asking you about contraception, sexual partners, pap smears, you know, female issues. We just decided that we would have it all done in Brisbane when we go down there and we see our friends. You know, it's not difficult. Anyway, I've made a follow-up an appointment, but it's in four weeks, the next school holidays. I'll probably give my surgeon a call, but, you know, I, I don't have a disaster plan because I never think about it coming back. It would be good to see somebody here, though. Well, I finally got around to going down to Brisbane for my appointment with Roberta, my GP. Uh, Roberta was great. She made um, Sam and I feel really, really comfortable. She was concerned about the new lump in my left breast, so she did get me to go and have it assessed. We were able to stay at our friend's place in, in Brisbane, which was great, because I had to have um, a mammogram, an ultrasound and a biopsy. I know all these terms now, I didn't know them before. <laughs> absolutely flying blind last time. Didn't have a clue. Mind you, I was still really anxious about it because um, I had to have some extra genetic tests that I didn't have last time.